You're with News 5 tonight. Tragedy at a construction site on Thompson Road around 8.30 this morning. A man died after being trapped inside a toppled excavator. When rescuers arrived, the excavator was half buried in debris, the operator's body trapped inside. Recovery work was hampered because the operator's cabin was pinned by a concrete slab. A crane was used to stabilize the heavy machine before rescue work could go on. We had used another excavator with a hydraulic uh, cutter attached to slowly cut away the concrete uh, beams and the concrete flooring that were pressing against the driver's cabin. Uh, and uh, once that was done successfully, we were able to go in, uh, do some further fine cutting uh, to, to uh, gain access into the cabin and remove the casualty. Paramedics pronounced the victim, Mr. Lo Chin Lam, dead just before 2 o'clock in the afternoon. He was a Singaporean in his late 50s. According to preliminary findings, Mr. Lo was operating the excavator on the first story when the floor gave way. The excavator toppled and fell to the basement level, partially buried by rubble, with him trapped inside. Channel News Asia understands Mr. Lo leaves behind children, a wife and elderly parents. I did inform my uncle, he's a uh, his parent already. Now they are waiting at home. But this morning, they already, his father already watched the television. They, they, they saw some construction, uh, this excavator collapse, but he, he still don't know his son. But now he knows already. Uh, so I already informed him. Uh. The work site is on a busy stretch of Thompson Road and used to be a row of shops and apartments known as Novenaville. Workers have been tearing down the building for redevelopment. After some five hours, the rescue operation is over, but work continues here at the construction site. Workers have been cutting through wire and concrete and trying to lift the toppled excavator out of the hole that is half buried in. Authorities have ordered all work at the site to stop, and the Manpower Ministry is investigating the accident.